And it's Ito. And I'm Jeff Aquar. We are Kitchenette, <laughs> the little kitchen with a lot of flavor. We are back for one of our side dishes, which is... Joe thinks you won an Oscar. I did win. News. Thank you. I'd like to thank my supporters for everything. <laughs> for our side dish, we have a beautiful one based on the movie Les Miserables. Mmm, what a beautiful movie. It was beautiful. And what's more beautiful is going to be our side dish called Les Miserables as in broccoli broccoli And so I'm going to show you how we take a few simple ingredients and we put them together to have a new flavor and new taste to our broccoli rob. Okay, so we have four simple ingredients. We have the broccoli rob, shallots, butter, and the zest of a lemon. So I'm going to just finish cutting up my shallot in really thin slices. We're going to put that in the bowl with the rest. And then I'm going to show you how to cut the broccoli raw. Okay, a lot of people don't know, but this is a little bitter. And so we're going to cut off the stem so it's not so harsh. And then we can pull it apart to make smaller bites. Or you could leave it a little more sturdy and just break it off like that. It's really easy to do. You can even go like this. It's like a pea almost or a bean. So we're going to do that with this. And then join me over at the stove as we put it all together. Okay, we're at the stove and we're going to start sauteing our shallot and stick of butter. So we have a half cup of butter, which is one stick, that we're going to melt down. And then what we're going to do is get this going really well here. We're going to add the shallots and we're going to get these to be more translucent than they actually are. And the shallot is similar to a red onion, but not as quite as harsh. It's got a really nice flavor to it. It's also kind of garlicky. And it is a little garlicky. It's not as uh, strong as a red onion and not as sweet as a white onion. So you can melt this down. We'll come back in a second. We're going to add the broccoli rabe and the lemon zest to the top. Okay, we're going to add the lemon zest to this and we're going to take one lemon and just keep on zesting away until we got it all covered. And it's going to give it a nice little flavor going in before we add the broccoli rabe. And also we're going to add the salt and pepper at this point too. And let that cook through with the butter and melt. And that way you won't have a lot of big pepper flakes. So we're going to put the pepper in. Just about a half a teaspoon. And then about, oh, a fair amount of salt. If you like less salt, feel free to add less salt. But do know that the broccoli rob will absorb the salt, so you want to make sure to season properly. Okay, so now we're going to bring it back to a medium heat. Our onions are very translucent. The shallots. Shallots, sorry. And we're going to add the broccoli rob. Oops. So you just add it all. It's easier to do it with your hand. And you can hear it cooking already. I can smell the other entree in there. And we're going to just bring this around a little. And then we're going to cover it. And let it cook down for a brief second until it kind of all goes down a little. And then we'll toss it together. Okay, we're plating our broccoli rabe, our shallot, salt and pepper, and a little lemon zest. And then get it in here and give it a tasting. Let's check this out. I think this is probably the best she's ever had. I dreamed a dream in dishes gone by. Mm. Mm. What do you think? Mm. That's really good. It's very rich. I can't wait to eat more of it when we turn off this camera in fact. <laughs> If you like this recipe or any of the recipes that we show you, please follow us on, on Twitter, Twitter or like us on Facebook or go to www.kitchenet.com <laughs> for, for more exciting stuff. And definitely enjoy the Oscars. Exactly. Les Miserables for Les Miserables. Adequa. Zita. <laughs>